Alright guys, welcome back to a new video. And today I want to show you guys how to make this egg icon right here. Now obviously this right here is not too complicated. But I'm going to walk you guys through step by step. So anyone can follow along. Anyways, let's start. The first thing I did was I changed the background color. So if you want to do the same thing. I'm going to give you guys the hex code. Which is A4BDD1. You're going to want to hit Alt and backspace so if i change to white all backspace it will change the color as you see all right so once we have that we're going to make a new layer and we're going to start for this uh we could either use our pencil or we could use our ellipse tool both work i'm going to show you with the pencil so we're going to go down to the pencil right here and for fill we're going to make sure we're going to go for the color black and stroke you want to make sure this is off so uh, the first option right here let's start I'm going to zoom in and with our pencil let's go up here let's uh, just click and I'm going to move my mouse to around here and we're going to and we're going to click and hold you want to drag um, this until it follows the curve as you can see Right here we're just gonna do the same thing again and just follow this egg shape as you can see this is very good practice for using the pencil which is a very useful tool for creating basically anything um, right here if you want to reset the curve as you can see if you click it uh, follows the previous curve but if you want to reset this curvature you want to hold alt and click on the blue square right here and as you can see now we could remake a new curve just like that now you can't see this layer because i have it beneath so drag this above and here we have our egg shape like so we could rename this to egg and now we could go here double click and change the color to white just go for solid white we're gonna hit okay and now for the shading which is the main part let's go for a new layer we're gonna go we're going to go right click and hit create mask as you can see and what this will do is if we go to our brush tool and we brush this will clip this brush layer inside the egg shape let me undo that real quick. All right, so here if you see the shading of this egg, the shadow is very strong. Right about here, it fades a bit towards uh, the upper part, and there is, and it's very faint here. So this area is the brightest, as you can see. But uh, let's go for our brush tool, and the opacity. I want to drop this down. Because if you have the opacity too high, it's very difficult to properly shade. Um, flow, we're gonna make sure this is somewhat low as well. Probably like around 25%. I think it's fine. And most importantly, make sure your hardness is at zero or at least under 10. So I'm gonna go for zero just to keep it simple. Now we're gonna hold Alt and we're going to click on this color to select it so we're just going to start painting um, up here first just going to apply this very light shade and slowly work our way all right so this will go here this part is a lot darker than the rest we're going to work our way up right here this has a bit of shading as well just go around the egg so here boom all right and I think this looks pretty good now there's also a little white highlight here so let's go for the egg layer right click and hit Blending options right here. We're going to go for inner shadow. 
the color is is white hit okay choke will be all the way up and we're going to use angle and distance now we're going to add a second inner shadow and with this one we're going to go for the pink color we're going to change the angle and decrease the choke increase the size uh this has to be a bit more red i would say so that looks better. Decrease the opacity. All right, looks fine to me. Next, we're gonna add a drop shadow. Adjust the angle. Something just like this right here. Boom. All right, now to make the pattern, we're going to make a new layer. Right click and right click and create a mask. And take our pencil. I want to change. I'm gonna change the color back to black. And we're just going to follow this curvature, just like so. Boom. And this will go around, just like that. We're going to bring this across. Double click and change the color. And now, as you can see, we have a very nice egg icon. You can add a stroke if you want to give it a more cartoony, cartoony look. Anyways, this is how you can make a nice egg icon. But yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. And follow all of our social media. Also, our Discord link is down below. And I'll see you guys next time.